The blooms that you just created are made out of salt. And salt is a type of crystal. But the salt you see now does not look anything like the salt you started with. First, the salt that you started with is square, cubed, or in chunks. And now it looks like a small blooming tree. All crystals have a natural way of forming, and something chunky or square is the natural way that salt forms. The liquid bluing is the ingredient that changed how that salt crystallized or how it formed. Second, the salt that you started with was white and now it is colored. The color of crystals are often influenced by what is around them. In this case, it was the food coloring that changed the color of the crystals. Third, the blooming branches in your crystal garden grow similar to a plant in a vegetable garden. Real plants suck water up from the soil and then send it to the branches. Your crystal garden is doing something similar. As the crystals form, the center of the branch looks like a straw that is sucking liquid up from the bottom of the bowl and pulling it toward the top of the branches where it dries into a blooming crystal. And it is the drying at the tips of the branches that pulls the liquid from the bottom. Now it's your turn to use the scientific method to learn more about crystals. Print off the worksheet and use that to help guide you through this process.